the best tools for TikTok for any creator, and best of all, they're free. I love free. I'm Phil Palin, a brand strategist. Welcome to my channel where I promise practical advice to build your brand. Today we're talking TikTok. Specifically, I'm sharing a few free tools that I've come across recently that every creator on TikTok will benefit from. Improving your content, increasing your followers, even scheduling your content. That's awesome. I'll share my screen now and show you up close. Okay, now that you can see my screen, the first tool that I wanna share with you, TikTok creators, is this one. If you have not heard of this one, you're gonna wanna add this extension to your Google Chrome immediately. It is called Sort for TikTok. It is exactly that. It allows you to sort videos of TikTok users, not just your own, by the most viewed. I absolutely love this tool. You would click here. I've already got it installed in my Chrome. If you don't, just click this button, it will get installed and let's actually give it a spin. So here you'll see my TikTok in its normal order. So my most recent TikToks are right here. I'll exit out of full screen so you can see this widget icon right up here. It is the S, you will click start. And in literally a second, my TikToks have been ordered in order of popularity. Why might you wanna do this, okay? Yes, it's true, I had one here, 4.5 million, that one went viral, that's my only one that's really gone super viral. But why would you do this? Because it's important as you plan your content moving forward to learn from the content that's performed well. You really only know by posting, right? What, what works, what doesn't. Just because you post once doesn't mean, and it doesn't take off, doesn't mean it's a failure, but this is the kind of thing that you wanna do. You wanna sort your feed by most popular and that should inspire more content that you want to make in the future. I love this tool. Next, if you've ever found yourself wanting to be able to, for example, post a TikTok onto Reels, it's a very good idea to get that TikTok watermark off your video because Instagram does not like that and they will likely limit your reach. So let me hop over to my own TikTok profile, grab a URL for a TikTok that I've recently posted, and I would just paste that URL right here into SnapTik. You've probably heard me talk about this before if you've been around my channel and watched TikTok content. It's literally as simple as this, pasting the URL and clicking the download button. Remember, you will get ads because it is a free tool. That's the price you gotta pay, but it's pretty awesome that it's free. And there you'll see your downloaded video, which we will open and just take a quick look at to make sure. And look, no watermark on here, just like that. Moving right along to our next free tool. This next one is all about hashtags. In fact, it is a hashtag generator for TikTok. So this is really awesome. You can actually just start with, let's say a hashtag relevant to your brand. In my case, it would be personal branding. This allows you to, first of all, search for hashtags. Once we actually do a little search for them, we'll be able to see what the uh, we'll be able to see what the top hashtags are and we'll be able to copy those. So right away, you can see here, I typed in personal branding and what it's doing, it's actually giving me the best hashtags to use. A single click, how awesome is that? It also gives me a second cluster here that I can use, which is really cool. Uh, overall post gives me a metric, overall views, that's a lot of views, the best related hashtags. So all you have to do is start with one and it's gonna give you lots of other ideas and lots of visualizations here for other hashtags that you can use for your post that are relevant. And finally, and certainly not least, one of my favorite tools, I'm certain you've heard me talk Talk about this before if you've been to my channel. Adobe Express is my favorite free tool for creating standout content quickly. Now you might think, Phil, how would I use Adobe Express for TikTok? Well, I'm a big fan of actually using Express in addition to TikTok's native editor. So in particular, I love that I can start with a template, a really beautiful template in Adobe Express. This will load for me here in just a moment. This is a text-based design that will live beautifully with other video that I might shoot of myself, maybe pointing or giving answers and ideas. I love that Express makes it really easy to start with a design, okay? So I love this, really simple, beautiful design. I can customize this with all different types of styles, so different fonts, colors, different backgrounds. There's a whole section here dedicated to different backgrounds. You can have a little look, and I think that you'll really enjoy this tool. One of my favorite things that you can do, and it's very, very easy, is to animate this. So right away, we click up here on the top right, and that's gonna turn this into a little bit more of an exciting, you know, visual 
you know, some movement and I can go ahead and download this as a video. It defaults to saving here as an MP4 video, which is gonna be perfect for TikTok. Remember, this is to create a simple, quick graphic, way more beautiful, way more interesting and customizable than you're able to make in the TikTok native app. In fact, you could make a whole video here with just text or graphics and just that simple little animation is going to be really, really helpful. I absolutely love this tool. And best of all, it's free. There is a premium version of Adobe Express, but certainly why don't you just get started with the free plan that is linked in the description below. There you go, handful of free tools for TikTok creators. I am linking to each one of them in the description below so you can try them out for yourself. If you've got any other lingering questions, comment below. Let's keep the conversation going on down there. I respond to those personally. And if you enjoy this video, give it a like. That helps other people discover these videos, which we work hard to create for you. And subscribe for more of my videos on branding, positioning, building, and promoting your brand. Next, I'm sharing a few videos I think you'll be interested in. I'm Phil Palin, thanks for watching. And those are coming up next.